Had an unbelievable little match out here, a little private de battle with Ericsson 3 since the equator. That's Mickey's little brother. Now they're just here and we're slowly catching on them. The one major we've had is Earl. Earl has clearly gained a lot of weight. I mean, it's sad. He's getting older. I laid down his bunk and he snapped one of the carbon rods on his bunk. Oh, it was Mickey. <laughs> he, did, he obviously weakened it. You can see we fixed it. He's used the winch handle. We don't have any winch handles left because they're all lashed to Earl's bunk. I hope you can sleep well. We're not going to get there very fast because we can't actually trim the sails. Got a fantastic night out here, really clear sky and, and beautiful stars. It's a, a shame that I can't take my kids out and show them this. I get a little bit romantic, I guess, you know, being out here. Guy ah, rockets in flight. Woo! Afternoon delight. Woo! Afternoon delight. Fiji, which is a 250 mile long island, is smack dab in our way, going upwind. We can't get around it. There's a gap in between two big islands. We have chosen, instead of tacking out, to try to kind of shoot this gap. It was easy, everyone had to be doing the same thing. <laughs> A4, A3, piano shot. Here we go again. Frickin' chess game, man. This whole thing is like the most slow motion chess game in the history of mankind. Ready. We will end up third um, at the scoring gate. Got beat by a couple boats. One of them's two miles ahead, the other one's six and a half miles ahead. Unbelievable.